Welcome back to Int Plus One Channel. This is Carl, and this is Let's Play 3D Dot Game Heroes, Episode 11. We are still Poochie. Uh, we may pick a different character next time. And in the last episode, we did a little bit of exploring, and honestly, I think we're better for it. And so I kind of want to continue the trend. There's a second village. Uh, There's a second village that we came across uh, in the desert. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to use one of those cool little wings. And I'm running out of these things, so. Uh, Maybe I should, uh, you know, use them sparingly, perhaps. We're going to use this, and we're going to travel over yonder. Okay, so we're going to Ortego Village. Now, also then, I think there's, yeah, there's also Colneria Village. We checked that out as well, but we didn't go to Ortego. So let's go there. Yeah, use a wind wing to warp. And it's funny, I tried to use it inside of the uh, castle, I think, and it, I just hit my head on the ceiling and I, I rolled down like, oh, that's not effective. Let's not do that. So let's talk to this guy. Long ago, a group of bandits hid out here. Rumor has it they hid their treasure somewhere in the desert. Oh, did you hear about the girl who won the martial arts tournament? Crazy. Why is that crazy? What, girls can't do martial arts? Oh, ridiculous. What is this? Is this the inn? Well, I'm in anyway. All right, nope, it's a house with some treasure chests stuck behind a bed. You're a hero, ain't you? So you carry money? Can you spare me 100 Gs? I actually can't. What a stingy hero. I don't have 100 Gs, bro. Whoops. Oh, I, that's not a person. That's like armor. Okay. Well, so we can't spare 100 Gs right now. Um, you know, we could earn 100 Gs and then do it. All right, let's see here. There's quicksand on the way to Candata Inn. To avoid it, try walking between the cacti. By the way, I heard a young foreign girl won the martial arts tournament. All right, so what is this? This is a character maybe we need to know then, right? This 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 girl who won the martial arts tournament because apparently that blows people's minds. Their little 3D sprite. Oh, okay. Well, they're not really sprites. They're almost like voxels. They're not quite voxels either, though. Huh. Dang it. Oh, no. That's... Uh, okay. All right. All right. No, no. We need to... So, apparently, I can't push that one to the right. I wonder if there's a way to determine from the way that they look uh, which directions they're capable of being pushed in. Like, for instance, um, I noticed that they're slightly different shades, unless that's just to do with the lighting and, and nothing else. All right, so obviously we have to push that one that way. And... I can do this. Okay, so that's that's the magic bullet there. That's how we do the thing. Got a life shard. I think I've only got three of them, though, so I'm, I'm kind of waiting for that fourth to go ahead and get me an extra heart. Yep. Apples and... It's like apples to hearts. Apples to oranges, apples to hearts. What is an apple? Mm, apple is delicious. What are hearts? Hearts are not delicious. I mean, unless you're, you know, like an Indiana Jones or something. Ah, uh, wow! What a beautiful ring! I'll trade you for my, my bestiary for it. Thanks. Wait. Okay. Cool. Got the bestiary. I didn't have any choice. Thank you so much. It's so heavy and sharp around the edges. Mom, Mommy told me not to hit anyone with it. Okay, so we got a bestiary. What does that do for us? I mean, oh, oh, all right. It's an actual literal item. Are we gonna equip it? I didn't literally mean to equip it. So, what? I, I'm actually unsure as to what that does. So we'll try and hit an enemy with it in a little bit, see what happens. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Want bottles? I ooh, I do. Yeah, if you say so. Yeah, I know. I totally want bottles. I'm just poor right now. I apologize. I will do better next time. All right, so we'll have to come back here. Um, let's see here. Ugh, water, water. The man seems to be in a great pain. Got a water jar. Please bring water from Colneria Village. Okay, we can do that. That's not even like a thing that I would consider to be difficult. Uh, okay. 
Such a cute kitty cat. I want to take it home. Meow. Yeah. yeah. Meow, meow. Okay. Uh. Okay. So, I mean, really, maybe I should just, like, kill some enemies and get some coinage, right? Hmm. This place is, uh, beautiful in the middle of the desert. It's, like, built around an oasis. Alright, there's an item shop and uh, a blacksmith and... If only I had uh, the light gem. Okay, well, I don't know. I don't have the light gem, apparently. Otherwise, I think it would have initiated, like, a thing where I gave it to him. This isn't near where they ask you to do something. You have all the items, and then you can just turn it in right away. It usually just seems to auto-exchange it. Would you like the poof poof? Only 10G. Yes! Great, come over here. I'll just dim the lights. Okay, lights off now. What? Poof, poof, poof. Hey, poof, poof, poof. Tee hee hee. What a nice feeling. What could it be? Wow. Ah. How'd you like the poofing, youngster? <laughs> Anytime you need it, just come on down. This is my dad. His back rubs are masterful. Well, back to work. If you need the poof poof, don't be shy now. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, I just met some crazy girl and poof poofed with her. And apparently, I think her father. I'm unsure as to how I feel about this as an exchange. So, we don't have an inn, but there's one to the south. Yep. All right, so we got some items. I actually thought it was gonna be an item, like an item called the poof poof. I didn't, I didn't know. Oh yeah, that's right, we can. Hey, you actually like, you leave it in. Buy whatever you need. Single arrow, make it count. Arrows, bombs. I ain't got jack. All right, so instead of wasting our last wing, <coughs> I think that I'm actually gonna unfortunately wander through the desert. And I'm not happy about that. I'm not gonna lie. I hate this place so much. Wait, did I talk to them? This town is lacking. If we had something special, maybe we would draw more visitors here. I heard about a great dancer in Ray Jack. Could you find her for me? Yes. You do that for me? Thanks. I'll wait here. All right. Cool. You know what? I don't have to strictly go that that one way, right? I can go up. Those little hopper things. All right, they got some coinage out of Ooh, a treasure chest. With a Lego block in it. I wonder what those do as collectibles. Oh, you know what? I bet you. Oh, you really can't? Oh, well, I, I that made sense to me. Oh yeah, that's right. Let's try and whack something with the bestiary. We'll see how that works. I'm really curious, like super ridiculously curious here. There's multiple exits and entrances and there's enemies back here. I know I've seen them. I do, I love the graphics in this game. I mean, maybe the depth of field is a little like over the top. Ah. I don't, I don't understand what that's doing though. Okay. Huh. Well, I sort of expected it to, like... I, I don't know what I expected it to do. Are you supposed to, like, hit enemies with the bestiary? Beast yeah. I'm so worried I'm gonna say something like not the word bestiary, uh, and it'll be terrible if I do, because I won't intend to do such a thing, but it's possible that I may. Now... I don't know what to do about the tree branch. I think I tried to blow it up with a bomb and it didn't work. Now, we were never able to do this before. Oh yeah. I got a wind wing. You know what? I totally want a wing wing. Wind wing. Okay, interesting. Oh, that just brings me back around. Wait, so. There's more though, right? There's more of the moving around that I can do. Aha, yeah, there we go. That's like a little bit of a puzzle here. 
like how to get around with these little wooden stick things. Oh, I hate that you do that. Ooh! Well, shoot, there's an area we could go to. We could be curious. I think. If I can find a way to get there to be curious in the first place. That didn't do anything. Uh, hmm. So, like, how does one get down there, maybe? And we got a wind wing, so, like, there's no real risk that I am aware of. Ah, oh, that's cool. I really like that. What's in this cave again? I'm sure we went there. This is my land, Sir Sanye says. This land is your land. This land is my land. Whoops. Hey, how's it going? Don't do it again. Don't do what again? Ah, I don't want to do it again. Does this do anything? That do anything? No. I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do or not do again. He's being so cryptic, right? <sighs> it's like, you know, it's like when someone tells you, you know, stop, um, you know what you did. No, I don't know what I did. If I knew what I did, I would not do this thing. Okay. Very cool. Wait, what? Are you serious? It's not, lo oh, wait. So I wonder if that's something you can take to the blacksmith and upgrade and, and maybe make it better. Uh, so then we can go to Death Mountain, or whichever thing that it happens to be called in this game. So that's unfortunate, though, because I wasted our time. I don't want to waste our time. I mean, is learning something wasting time? Not really. <coughs> but, you know, in real life, I'm, I'm very much sort of results-oriented, right? Like, I want to have results. I don't want to just... No. You know what? That's a quick way to the poor house. And I'm already pretty poor in this game. I need more coinage. Uh, ich bin ein König. What? Yes. Okay, so. Let's see. I'm feeling like I'm missing something now about, like, the where of which I can go that will get me out of my current situation where I'm, I'm going the same places repeatedly. Uh, maybe, maybe I'm just not remembering. Okay, no, this, this must be the way. And we could go to Ray Jack Village and find the, the, whatever, but you know what? L1 map. Where's the next area? All right, so it's still flashing for, for Dungeon 3. So, does that mean that I have to go back to Dungeon 3? Because I'm not happy about that, if that's the case. Ah! Sub it. Okay. All right, so... Wait, how do I... Oh. All right, so whatever... Oh, wait. Carl, what do you think actually could hurt a tree? You know what I think could hurt a tree? I think that a candle could hurt a tree. Okay, it won't work there. It's worth a shot, right? You know, maybe, maybe it would somehow... So there's probably some kind of like fire wand thing equivalent in this game. Oh, I hate getting hit. It's so disappointing. I wonder, then, do the upgrades affect only your upgraded form of your sword? Or do they, in fact, actually affect only the unupgraded form? And I wonder, then, too, if you're able to actually make your sword into your upgraded, like, your, you know, your full life version or whatever, right? Your, your max sword. So maybe you can actually have that sort of full time. Now that would be amazing, actually. I would really like that as like something that I could do. I'm no longer sure how entertaining this is uh, at the moment. I do know that I in fact have, wait, wait, so L1. I do in fact have the 100 Gs to get that other bottle. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm gonna go back to the village 
Wait, 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 no. But I never actually had to deal with that music on my way back to the village, so I think that it's in fact to the right. And now we will we will do a wind wing um, when we go back to that dungeon because it's still flashing and I guess I guess I'm just not doing something that I'm supposed to be doing. And I had a feeling that might be the case, but I don't know. You know, there was there was oh that's cool. Now, I wonder if I can use that into a tree to do something. Oh, you know, I wonder if it's those... <coughs> All right, you know what? Remind me when I see those... Uh, yeah, these things. Okay, no. I was wondering if that... Shoot! I like that. I just kind of leave it in there and... Uh... All right, why am I having the hardest time figuring out how to get back? Oh, no, I'm not having a hard time figuring out how to get back there at all. Instead, what I really need to do is I need to go... Oh, you know, there might be an item description then for the bestiary. So, that's not too bad. All right. All right, no, 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 I got this. And in fact, I know that there's areas that you can jump down um, after. Yeah, so that never works, apparently. I was hoping it might. So I still yet to discover, like, the true purpose of the boots. Um, you know, of course, in Legend of Zelda, you would use them, you'd knock into things, and, you know, stuff would fall out of things. You'd knock into trees, and, you know, you would see, uh, you'd get kind of cool stuff from time to time. But this just seems so far, and I, I doubt it, right? Like, I really doubt that this is all it does. Oh, come on, really? Ah, I just want to go fast. <laughs> like Sonic, gotta go fast, right? You know, oh, you can change direction with this version? And that's something you could not do in uh, Link to the Past. So cool. I know how I'm going to kind of blow through part of the, uh, part of the Dungeon 3. I can't remember which person it was needed or no. All right, so that's not it. And I should have remembered that. All right, that's okay. Uh, hmm. Which way lets me do the thing where I get the bottle of water? I remember there's someone this way. Wait, is he the one? Yes. Ding. Got an empty bottle. All right, thanks. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna actually uh, go ahead and and get some red potion stuff eventually to fill those water bottles or not? Well, they're not water bottles. Oh yeah, he wants the water from Corneria Village. Okay, so I can't do that right now, but that gives me some goals and some ideas for like I don't want to say filler episodes, right? Nothing about this game is like truly filler. I mean, it's it's a little fetch questy, but it's like in the fun way. Um, I, I feel like I get to sort of do it. Uh, okay, okay. Strength. So that's how you see that. All right, and there's obviously then other types of swords. I just have yet to come across them because of course we got our initial wooden sword. So I wonder, is the wooden sword perhaps, oh, it has no potential has no potential at all. All right, yeah. That's cool, that makes me think that there's a lot more that can be done with the uh, the item customization. So I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna save. Now, I'm starting to think though that saves might be redundant, right? And the only thing that a save is gonna save me from is if the uh, system crashes or something and does something stupid. Which, you know, that's never ideal. Like, I don't want the system to go and just Aw, oh, that's one of those things back there, and I can't get to it, right? Because in order to get to it, the area will have to reload. I was supposed to get 10 of those um, by that one guy's uh, preference, or, you know, like, it's like a little side quest, so. All right, we're gonna use a win wing. I hate to go back there, yeah. Oh, oh no. All right, totally kidding. We've got to go by foot. 
I am I am not super happy about that, but that's what we've got to do. Going by foot. Uh, okay. That's all right. You know, maybe we'll pick something up that we didn't pick up before. But really, this is gonna this is gonna be boring. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, you know, so you might want to just skip to the next episode because I think I'll end the next episode when I'm right outside the gates again of Dungeon Three. Um, but otherwise, you, can, you know, you're welcome to watch me, and, um, I'll, of course, try and make it as entertaining as possible. Um, I feel like I'm putting the idea that this episode is then going to be boring into your head. Oh, ooh, ooh, this is cool. This is a new area that we have access to. Access to. We have access to this new area. Oh, 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 okay. And we got a new shield. I know, whoa. Ah, Poochie, no! Poochie, no! Okay, all right. Yep, 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 ah, there we go. See, is this entertaining? Are you not entertained? Ah, these golem things. I don't know what's up with this one here. I've never seen that, like, species of the golems. Oh, God, he moves fast. And he's got, like, a club or something. Oh, he totally has a club. How much damage? Oh, yeah, I needed that critical hit. Yeah! Oh, please be a heart. I want another heart. Even better. Got the holy sword. Holy cow. Wow. Obtain the holy sword. Even get a trophy for that. Holy cow. I, yes, yes. That's what I want. <gasps> Look at its potential. Uh, I don't even care that it's not. Uh, oh. Holy sword. All right, I'm happy. No, this, this, that, that totally made this episode worth it. Uh, you know, if you see this area, totally go here because you need the holy sword. And and you can see its upgrade ability is just like through the roof. I'm so happy about this. Like I could talk about it for like the next ten minutes, but I'm not going to. Because that, oh, oh man, my eyes. I need to, you know. Okay. I... Interesting. And it's a little bit stronger. Oh, yes, check it out. We can get this treasure chest too now. It's just got a Lego block. And until I know what they actually do, wait. What? How do I get down from here? Oh, no, I don't, I don't get down from there. Okay. No, that's fine. I don't have to get down from there. Oh, I need some way to like earn more moolah or something. Oh, 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 yes. Oh yeah, it's this place. It's this place. I remember this place. Well, I also remember what I learned about this place. Uh, or, okay, we can go that way, I guess. Oh, and it kills them in one hit now. So, so happy about this. It's ridiculous. I'm just, okay. Uh, yeah. Can't remember which way to go. Right, let's go in a redundant loop. That's, that's gonna be helpful. hate this desert so much hate this desert so much okay wait so none of those ways actually are our way to fix it <coughs> I uh, I'm just gonna kind of say that's okay for right now that is okay honestly honestly because we're making it our way to the dungeon. Back to dungeon three, the, the funnest place on earth. Oh crap. This is actually not the way of which I meant to go. Big percentage sign, what is this? It's a secret to everybody. No, you know what? Oh, well it is a secret to everybody apparently. I'm gonna hit you with the bestiary. That doesn't do anything. No, no, no. Does this do anything? 
I don't see any blow upable walls or, or anything. I'm I'm disappointed. There's gotta be a point to that. Excuse me. What's this say? Follow your own path. The sign supports you, Sir Signe. Or Signe, maybe. Nope, there's nothing hidden there. I mean, I'm at least satisfied that, like, I right, so obviously I need to go back to that dungeon. And there was an area where it needed a key, but, like, I don't have a key for another area. So... So, wah, I'm complaining, right? I want to know... Aw, oh, really? Okay, you go here. We're gonna do... We're gonna go full circle. Ooh. And I think I can make it back to that dungeon in like five minutes. And that's where I'm gonna end the episode at. So hopefully, actually, our little accidental journey made this totally worth it, right? Because if you didn't see that, uh, okay. If you didn't see that, then you may have missed the cool sword that I'm gonna show up in the next episode with. So ha, right? Totally worth it. This is why we watch N plus one channel. All right, wait a second. I feel like there's gotta be a way. <gasps> ah, that's exactly how you do it. Okay, no, no. So, yeah. Okay, what did that do for me? It did nothing for me though, right? I mean... Oh, no, I'm a liar. It totally, uh, it did that thing for me. Uh... No, no, no. Shoot, 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 okay. So that way, that way. And... Okay. And then... Oh, wait, no. No! Oh, why do I keep doing that? I'm trying to actually just walk to the left. All right, whatever. It's fine. I'm just, I'm gonna let that go. It's causing me some agitation. All right. I'll just come back to that. Oh, this is so much better of a shield. It actually will, uh, it'll protect you against that garbage. I'm happy about that. All right, now which way was it that literally went there? Oh no, not this junk again. No wait, actually this part's not too bad. Okay. I think it's actually just straight up, no. Oh no, it's down, all right, it's down the yellow brick road. Or the some kind of brick block road kajigger thing. I own this many shares of space kajigger. Okay. Sorry, I actually used to be, and maybe still am then, a huge Futurama fan. Uh, it got me through some really hard times in life, actually. Um, I hated that I only saw it well, you know, I didn't like it when I first saw it many, many years ago, like when it first debuted, and I remember it being on, like, Fox, and they were like, oh, Futurama, it's gonna be great, and then people were like, no, we don't think it's great, it's far too intelligent and far too interesting, we think The Simpsons is better, so they took it off the air, of course, and then, you know, we saw its resurrection, um, it had a wonderful resurrection, although that first season when they started uh, Futurama back, was had a little had a few rough uh, episodes. Got better around uh, the Prisoner of Benda, um, and then um, a Clockwork Origin. I actually thought was a brilliant episode. Well, no, wait, no, it's not a Clockwork Origin. Wait, wait. How? Oh yeah, yeah. I've got to go around. No, no, that's fine. I remember now. I got to go around. Uh, no, it was the one with the time travel, and I'm struggling to remember that name, actually. But it was the one where, you know, the cavern on the green, and oh, it looks so cool when it's big. 
Did you see that? This holy sword is holy cow amazing. Okay, yes. Bloop. Bloop. I'm actually really looking forward to kind of doing my initial tour of the seventh generation game. So I can go back and uh, I, I'm going to go and do some fourth generation games soon. Because um, I've been focusing a little bit too much, I think, on the PlayStation 3. Now, I mean, obviously a lot of cool stuff came out last generation. But really, there's, there's an amazing array of games out there, just period. So... I want to thank you, actually, right? We're at the end of this episode. I've taken, I don't know how many time. I can't see it from here. But uh, I had a great time. I hope you had a great time. We got a cool new sword. Um, and you know what? We're going to set a new resurrection point. Um, so we'll start fresh, and everything will be great. So I'd like you to subscribe. I'd like you to comment. I'd like you to engage me in this, right? You know, it's funny. Um... I have like tons of videos and not a lot of views and that's okay right because by the time I don't know you know make enough noise people are gonna notice so whatever right I'll get all these comments you know on this video like two years in the future and I'll be like yeah I don't even remember this part what are you talking about 3d dot game heroes who's from software hopefully that'll never happen I mean I don't want to go into some you know early senility thing but I had a great time subscribe like on facebook uh and i'm hoping also to throw up the website soon i own the domain name and i haven't stuck it up there and that's because i'm working on it and really that means i need to start it so hopefully that'll happen thanks for watching i'll see you next time